Hello. In this video, I'll provide an overview of Big Switch Networks Community Edition and walk through a simple process of installing and configuring the Big Cloud Fabric Controller software. It is important to review the use cases that can be explored with Big Cloud Fabric. When you install the Community Edition, you're welcome to take advantage of comprehensive integrations with OpenStack or VMware. Alternatively, you can just use BCF as a robust and extremely simple physical network solution for a variety of workloads. Let's look at the Community Edition itself. It is a free version of Big Cloud Fabric and Big Monitor and Fabric software, limited in terms of supported switching hardware, features, and scalability with best effort support. However, don't let it fool you as you can do a lot of things with one pair of switches in Big Cloud Fabric or one switch in Big Monitor and Fabric. Here's the workflow we'll follow. We'll install the Big Cloud Fabric Community Edition controller, set it up, and then add a switch to the controller. We have already downloaded OVA appliance for Big Cloud Fabric. In this example, we'll try to deploy OVA on an ESXi server. It is important to select the right network, which has a layer 2 connectivity to switch management interface. Once OVA boots up, we'll follow a setup script to do initial configuration. We can log into the controller, review and accept end user license agreement, type an IP address for controller management interface. Along with controller management, this interface will also be used to communicate with the switches. We can then configure additional information. Here I'm doing a brand new setup, so I'll start a new cluster and provide some information about the cluster. Finally, we can configure NTP and accept entire configuration. Now controller is ready and we can log into it via graphical user interface. Let's proceed to add a switch based on its MAC address. We can make a switch part of a leaf group and apply a storm control profile. Remember, in order for this to succeed, switch and controller have to be layer 2 adjacent by their management interfaces. Now, zero touch fabric operations will start. The switches will use ONI or Open Network Installer Environment to communicate with controller as well as download appropriate image and configuration. We can add a second leaf in the leaf group in the same way. Now we have added two switches that are connected to each other via peer link. They automatically discover each other using LODP and propagate that information to the controller so that they can program the network appropriately. This was extremely simple as we did not have to configure any files or access the switches to do the initial setup. We can now configure port groups, segments, and tenants. We are ready to experience Fabric integration with OpenStack and VMware and take advantage of many more things that Big Cloud Fabric has to offer. We encourage you to register for Community Edition and try it out. For more information on deploying various use cases with, with Big Cloud Fabric, please visit bigswitch.com or follow us on Twitter. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.